March Madness, it giveth and it taketh away. Unfortunately, college basketball's big dance continuing without our local faves. KU, K-State, and Wichita State all bounced this weekend. However, there's one big player representing Olathe as we move on to the Sweet 16 now. Fox 4's Sean McDowell with more on the local talent who helped shock the unbeaten Wichita State Shockers. We had some professional photographers come in. In these high school hallways, it's hard to find a player that's any bigger. It was merely two years ago that Kentucky forward Willie Cauley Stein was a high school star. Helping the Ravens jam home back to back Sunflower League championships in 2011 and 12. You just saw things that you've never seen before. Mike Grove was there for every bounce of the ball. He's been the Ravens head coach since the school opened in 2003. Grove isn't surprised at all seeing Cauley Stein help Kentucky to the Sweet 16, the team that booted previously unbeaten Wichita State. His body was, it was thin, but it was strong, and uh, he just had a, a great. Um, athletic presence about himself. Basketball is serious business to Will Shields, the retired Kansas City Chiefs lineman who serves as a mentor of sorts to Cauley Stein. Will helped Willie transfer from tiny Spearville High. Being seven foot and having that, that wingspan makes a big difference in the middle. It, it causes people to alter their shots or not even go in the middle. And when Cauley Stein moved to Olathe Northwest before his junior year, athletic director Jay Novacek says the butterflies nearly got the best of the big kid from the country. As he told me his first day, my whole town could fit inside of this school. So to watch him go from uh, Olathe all the way to Lexington is uh, you know, pretty special. Cauley Stein's future looks bright too. Not only is he two victories away from the final four, but many NBA draft boards have him being selected in the first round, and those projections are being based on potential that's still coming together. There's nothing in the game of basketball that Willie Cauley can't do. But the future has to wait. His present situation might be too good to miss. Sean McDowell, Fox 4 News, working for you in Olathe. Kentucky, of course, moving on to next week's round of 16. Olathe Northwest graduate Siobhan Shields, he also made the NCAA tournament, but his Nebraska team beaten, of course, by Baylor, which beat Creighton last night. As for Collie Stein, he and his Kentucky teammates take on Louisville. Oh, boy, it's that big Kentucky rivalry this Friday night. Mike?